Hello, Brian Myers with Winning Solutions, Inc. and the Microsoft Access Experts. Today we're going to continue off of our last tutorial where we learned how to create a basic table. If you haven't already completed that tutorial, I'll put a link to that in the description below. For those of you who have already completed that tutorial, we'll pick up right where we left off. Last time we created a basic employee table with some fields, all set as text values. And now what we're going to look at is what information out of this table do we want required when new records are added. So we'll go ahead and go back to our employee table. We'll right click and go to design view. And here we have all of our fields that we entered from last time. And I'm going to just go through and start with the first name here. And for each record, I'm going to say that this is a required field. So I can go down to the field properties down below and find the required option and select yes. I'm going to continue to do this for the fields that I would like to be required for entry of new records. The middle name I don't want required, that's not important to me, so I'll go ahead and skip that one or leave it to required no. And then the last name, yeah, I think I want that required, so I'll come down and select the required option. I'll do the same with department, position, start date, email address, phone number, and the created date. And that ends this tutorial. This tutorial was just meant to show you how to change fields within a table to required. Please continue watching us, and I'll put a link to the next tutorial in the description below. Also, give us a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up to date with all of our tutorials and our demos of our database templates and products. You can also follow us on Facebook or Twitter or join our circle on Google+. Feel free to contact us for any access development that you may need, whether it be a current project or a new project, whether you are using one of our database templates, or you just need some help with your access development. Thank you and have a great day.